Alrighty, quick update here. We've been making some good progress. I uh, got the new old drive on it. Okay. Had to relocate the uh, the carrier here. Cut the shaft. Rework the motor mounts. There's your your clutch. So this this mount would normally just slide on to a you know onto that hub. So in order to get it to work there, she's gonna slide in and I got a special stubby drill bit that I made that I can't find it and I gotta go spend some family time. But she slides she's gonna slide in like that and it's sitting down that's basically I'll have to take four bolts out to take it out yeah it's all in that's actually sitting right where it's supposed to be clutch spins nice and freely so the hard part's done um, so I push the motor back Means I'm gonna have to hack up the cow pretty good to, uh, well, you know, not hack it up, but I'm trying to make it look nice. But it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. So I'll get the water pump in tomorrow. Figure out the exhaust. I'm gonna have to do something different because of the way I pushed it forward. And see how this exhaust pipe works. It just comes out this back hole with a ring, right? So it's obviously kind of designed for being set in one spot. So you can kind of see what I'm going to be dealing with right here. See how it's nice and tight there? But I'm I'm not there anymore. I'm back, you know, back here. Or something like that so I'll have to look and see who makes a something to fake out this hole oops you know what I mean tighten that back up just in the small grommet one of those guys Connecticut kinetic racing or Bonzi or whatever they'll have I can order something here for that. But I'll stuff it around. I'll, I'll wrap that pipe with the pipe wrap there to tighten it up in that hole just for the short term. So, that's that, folks. Over and out here. I'm in trouble already with the wife, so I gotta go. Peace.